Hi guys and welcome back to another one of my daily cocktail videos. Today I'm going to show you how to make a pina colada two ways. Well, probably the most common way to make it is using a blender. I like doing it this way because then you obviously get the, uh, the fresh pineapple in as well. So to start off, white rum, so Bacardi. I'm going to measure a double shot, so 60 mils. Then next, pineapple juice. So 90 mils. And then coconut cream, so about 30, 45 mils. Then add five or six pineapple pieces to your blender base. And add a scoop of ice, so there's probably about maybe, these are fairly large cubes, but there's probably about 10 ice cubes in there. Make sure you have a good quality blender and just pulse it. Now transfer it to your glass. A little bit extra. Mm. It's really good, especially with the, the fresh pineapple. And garnish with pineapple wedge and a pineapple leaf. So there's a blended pina colada. And for those who don't have a shaker, it's, it's exactly the same recipe. The only difference is I'm just gonna pour it over crushed ice. So 45 to 60 mils of rum. Ninety mils of pineapple juice. And 30, 45 mils of coconut cream. Now, if you did have fresh pineapple and you still wanted to include that in your shaking cocktail, then you can always put it in the base of the shaker and give it a good bottle. So fill the cocktail shake with ice and give it a good shake. So fill the glass with crushed ice. And strain over the top. Same again, garnish with a pineapple wedge and a pineapple leaf, and if you like, maraschino cherry. So there you have the pina colada two ways. You got the blended version with the addition of the fresh pineapple, so it's gonna be a sweeter. Uh, personally, I prefer this way, but if you're stuck, if you don't have a blender, then you can always do it shaken and throw it over crushed ice. So there you have two pina coladas. Cheers. Oh, 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 oh,